This may be the first thing the enemy sees on the battlefield. But it may also be the last. It's one of the most advanced helicopters ever built. The Apache Attack Helicopter. How do you build one of the meanest helicopters on the planet? Find out now on Mega Factories. This is no traffic helicopter. It's an Apache, a machine designed and built for one purpose, to seek out and destroy enemy forces. It's a tank killer, and it's one of the fastest and stealthiest attack helicopters in the world. is one beast that sees with its nose. It contains a powerful targeting system that allows pilots to see more than 19 kilometers ahead. The whole turret can turn 120 degrees to either side. In the top turret, a video camera and telescope for the gunner. That's for operating in daylight. But on the bottom, the tool that gives the Apache a real edge, a night vision sensor. It enables the Apache to find and attack the enemy under cover of darkness, just as easily as if it were broad daylight. The night, which is what we try to fight the most without any lights on, this airframe is extremely stealthy. So it increases our survivability. Pilots see the pictures from the video camera and sensors on an eyepiece that contains a two and a half centimeter TV screen. Got it. Oh, yeah. Information bombards them in the eyepiece. Thermal imaging of where they're flying. Airspeed, altitude, heading, and targets. The latest Apache gets an even more powerful tool, the Longbow Radar. Over the battlefield, this radar scans 360 degrees for objects in the air and 270 degrees for objects on the ground. The Longbow analyzes if what's out there is a tank, a truck, or a plane, even whether it's friendly or not by comparing the radar information to its database. It's just very important at night, extremely important that you get a very good target handover of where the target is and where the friendly location is so you're not attacking the wrong people. Because this dome sits high on top of the Apache, the Apache can go undercover, hiding out of sight while it's scanning to see who's out there. The Apache can fire its missiles and make a quick getaway before the enemy even knows it's there. The Apache must attack and make a quick getaway. The more agile and aerobatic it is, the better. Most helicopters aren't made for aerobatics. The stresses on the airframe cause a deadly level of vibration, and the helicopter breaks apart. 
the Apache solution? A static mast. Workers attach the rotor to a mast that's fixed to the helicopter with four V-shaped struts. Just four bolts hold the mast and rotor in place. So you have basically four bolts holding the main rotor head to the helicopter. The drive shaft that spins the rotor runs through the mast. So the mast absorbs the aerobatic stresses, not the drive shaft or transmission. This helps reduce vibration. Now, last thing I want to have this thing fall off air. The mast allows the Apache to swoop, flip, and turn sharply without risk of dangerous vibration. It's uh, extremely responsive. Anytime I make an input to one of the controls, it happens almost instantaneously. 